um, I, I really, that I respect. It's really exciting. It's almost like, I don't know what the word would be, a milestone maybe for me. <laughs> um, it, was, it was a half-finished song. It was kind of like a song sketch that had lyrics to it. They were like, this is almost like this, this, this really kind of works with the scene of, of friendship. Don't let it ever go back. Don't let that be the best. I wonder what it would have been if you were still moving It was heartwarming, it was touching. It was real for so many people and so many levels. And I wasn't a big fan of Tyler Perry, but I think he did a good job. It's a beautiful story. It's things that happen. It's just that, oh my goodness, it was just too much for me. At some point I wanted to, to leave. A lot of people like, like sitting around me were struggling with the poetry because I, I guess they didn't know what to expect, you know what I mean? But I like the whole way that Tyler Perry fused everything into it, plus made the relevant issues heard. I think every woman represented a bit of, of a bit of you with all the characters, so it was quite intense. It's real. It's not Hollywood stuff. It's no pretense. It's what's happening in our communities and our parents raise us up to, to think it's okay to be to be abused. And I think as, as a current generation it's very important for us to address these issues. I think it was kind of balanced. I mean there were um, there were some good portrayals of men and there were some bad portrayals of men. Of all the main characters that stood out were all bad, bad, bad. Of all the good guys like um, the loving husband, etc. It was just a little bit of a snippet of like, yeah, here's one, but it's not really relevant. But I guess the agenda wasn't really that, like in this particular movie. So. Thank you.